Hey guys, it's Jill. Welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, welcome. So today's video is going to be someone I have not tried on in a really long time or done a try on or even shopped from for a really long time, but it's torrid. So yeah, I got a couple of pair of shoes and then I also got some denim or some shorts. Unfortunately, only one of the pairs fit, but I'm going to show you in still in, in I don't care because uh, these are some really cute things. I personally am not going to size up on them because of the fact that I am in the process of losing weight. I know y'all have been hearing that for the past five, six, seven years. I know, but for real, for real, I really am. And I'm doing things a lot different this time. So I really want to see myself this time next year in at least a size 20, 18. That would be, that would be great. Um, so with that being said, I have these shorts. They don't fit. I got upset. I went ahead and I ordered because I'm starting to work out more and I'm like, I don't have many workout clothes. So I have more shoes and workout clothes coming. So this is gonna be, this is all gonna be one video, but it's gonna be in, filmed into two parts. So I'm gonna do this first one. I'm gonna show you the shoes and the jeans or the shorts. Um, and then, yeah, everything's going to be linked down below. So. Let's get into it. So these are an absolute dream. Every single pair, I got a 24. I have some, like, I thought they were workout shorts. We'll get to those in a minute. Those are a size 3X. But yeah, 24 is my, it's like true to size. And these fit beautifully. Like, they are kind of like a mid to kind of high rise. I love the pockets. I love the distressing. I love where it lays, but it also, it came rolled up, but it wasn't stitched. So you can, and these are modeled to be rolled up and they're stretchy enough to where you can totally do that. I personally don't want something quite that short. I guess if I had the option, I would prefer this length right here, which is a perfect length because it's not quite a Bermuda, but it's not quite a shorty short either. These just, they fit so well. They feel so good. So I really love these and I have been wearing the heck out of them the past week since I got them, but they have pockets in the front. They also have pockets in the back. Not too much gapping or not gapping at any gapping at all, which is great. And they just, they feel really good. They fit really well. These shoes are here, which again, I will come to a close up, but they're just like basic T-strap sandals that have nice memory foam. They're wide width, so they fit my feet perfect. And I can't sit here and say that I can walk miles in these sandals, absolutely not. But I can go shopping or I can go be out for like several hours and wear these and not have my feet dying whereas i made the mistake of not thinking one day well this is when i realized oh i can't wear these kind of shoes anymore i went to the mall with i have some tory birch and they have no padding or anything because you know skinny girls don't need padding i never needed padding I mean, some do, it all depends on your foot, but I know that I never needed it before I got this, this weight. So yeah, I made that mistake and my feet were dying. And I told my kids, I was like, we can't walk them all like, like we had planned because my feet are killing me. <laughs> so yeah, that kind of prompted me to be like, um, I'm gonna need some of these. So yeah, I would be able to walk them all for several hours, fine, no, no problem, but um, you know, I can't be running or walking any marathons or walking miles or anything like that in them, but they're very comfortable and they serve their purpose for sure. And I have been getting tons of use out of these and they also have these in several different colors. Here they are close up again, very cushiony, very comfortable, love, love, love. And they're just a basic go with anything you can you know, sundress, maxi dresses, shorts, jeans, linen pants, whatever. To the pool, you can wear these with pretty much everything and anything and they're gonna match and they're gonna go and they're gonna look good. So 
Yeah, highly recommend. Military style short is what these are called. They are pretty short, but I still really love the length of them. They are more of a dressy, but still kind of casual dress down short, if that makes any sense. These are a size 24. These are very cute. They have nice belt loops. The last ones had belt loops, by the way, too. They have cute little pockets. They have little buttons right here on them. The side is cuffed. Also has buttons right here. You have buttons on the pants or on the back pockets. These are functioning back pockets. They are a little short, but I don't mind them. They are just too, also like, they're definitely not they're kind of like a mid-rise would almost go to say like well no i wouldn't say low rise <sighs> they just they just don't they just don't fit right they just don't and they're really hurting my thighs and then when i sat down in them and i was like whoa because i was thinking i was like well will they stretch out hold on one second you guys no these are stitched i was about to say can i unroll these because i feel like if i could unroll them then I would be okay. But my issue here is definitely the sizing of the leg hole. And they are stretchy. Maybe they would stretch out, but I don't know. I was looking really forward to having a nice kind of dressier pair of black shorts, but I can't with the thigh, so whatever okay these size 24 these are some short t shorts i got these because i have a pair very similar to these from the no boundaries brand at walmart for less i think that they were like 12 bucks so inexpensive and they were so good such good quality and i went ahead and i got these because i thought that they were going to be similar to the no boundaries because these are like $60. I thought they were actually going to be better because the no boundary ones were like $13. No, the no boundary ones are made better. They're better quality and they have more stretch right here in the leg because I've talked about this before in the video in which I tried and I hauled those shorts from Walmart where I was like, oh my gosh, this is amazing. What an amazing concept to have this distressing right here so you can have like a little bit of extra stretch. Well, y'all see what's happening right here. First of all, I'm gonna bust through this. I'm gonna bust through this if I wear them. So then it's gonna be even shorter and it's gonna, it's gonna take away from what I wanted in the first place. They're just too tight. They are just too tight. They're so cute though. They have functioning pockets, very distressed very short i like these a lot i really 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 do but they just don't fit me right so here they are on the back again they have the fraying so they're not like super distressed but they are frayed and they're cut off shorts and then you have pockets in the back the one pocket does have distressing this one also has distressing but yeah they're just not going to work for me because I'm going to, um, these are going to break. They're going to break and then I'm not going to like them at all. So unfortunately, these two do not fit. But I wanted to show you these shoes, which unfortunately they're so cute. But again, they don't fit. They are, for something being wide width, it's really weird because they're too, they, they feel too tight around my, my, the top of my foot I'll show you okay so here they are they are so freaking cute they're padded they're espadrille very 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 on trend for the summer like these shoes are everywhere the little tie around the ankle these these those kind of shoes are everywhere too so my problem with this is like as I walk and I know it might be ridiculous for y'all but as I walk it looks like this the front part of my toe like goes over the shoe and I do not like that look but also this part of the shoe starts to hurt my foot like it's 
it's uncomfortable. So these unfortunately are a no, but I saw so many reviews of people saying that these worked for them. So maybe they'll work for you. Give them a try. I don't know. Maybe I actually needed to stay with a nine on these and not go down to an eight and a half. That's probably what it is, but these are so cute. And if they weren't so tight around the foot right here, they would be absolutely perfect. But unfortunately, they are just a little too tight. And then I don't like how my foot, like my foot will eventually kind of go up like this. So y'all see that? And then it's like my foot is over the end of the foot. And I just, I don't think that's cute at all. Do you see? That's where my foot ends up once I'm like actually like walking around. So not cute, but these are really cute shoes. Next, I have these bike short nine inch inseam size three. They have a pocket, which is a must for me. And I was like, oh my gosh, I need workout shorts. Let's get them. Available in sizes zero, zero to six. Perfect fit, rave reviews, bestseller. Here's why. High rise waistband. It's great. Thicker fabric that smooths and flatters. Mm. But like, does it really? Like. Mm. And then it's also, if I'm not mistaken, see-through? Um. Four-way stretch with great recovery, nine-inch inseam. My issue with these is that they are see-through. They, yes, they fit, but in all actuality, do they really? They're, these are a size three. Um, in all actuality, do they really? Because they're stretching to capacity, and that is why they are see-through. And I don't like that. I also, for a biker short, if I'm gonna work out, I want something to be a little more, just a little more, a little more, um, so I'm not jiggling everywhere. These, these just don't have the kind of um, suction, the kind of fit that I'm looking for. I don't like the way that my hips look in these at all. And even if I were to wear a shirt up over it, I just still didn't feel confident and cute. So I don't know. I mean, I just, I felt like ex overexposed. I don't know. I just, I don't like them. They, they do fit really good though. I mean, they do feel really good. And they're very, very comfortable. But I would much prefer. I thought these were gonna be workout leggings. That was my that was my bad. It was my fault. Um, these are more so the kind of leggings or the kind of shorts, the kind of biker shorts that you're gonna wear with an oversized tee. And that way it's going to kind of give you this look where you have the t-shirt or the tunic shirt covering your butt. And you're not gonna worry about any of this because I mean, it's not like I feel like, you know, I am pushed in and I don't feel like I'm super wiggly jiggly. Well, yeah, I am, I truly am. Um, and then if you put like a shirt like this, which is soft and that also kind of like wiggly jigglies your stuff. I don't know, I just don't like them. I just don't like them, so. Here's the last of it for this part of the Torrid Haul. Okay, hey guys, I am back with the rest of my Torrid Haul, which let me tell you, it's good. These shorts, by the way, are the shorts. I've been loving them. I have been obsessed with them. This is a size two, 1820, love. They probably don't have this anymore, but everything will be linked down in, in the description box in the order at which I tried it on in. Hopefully most of it is still available, but I can say all of these were like gone pretty much immediately. I like this shirt a lot. Y'all are gonna see me wearing this a lot because it fits perfect. You don't see my bra. It just has a cute little cut right here. 
it just it looks good and you can wear it you know I could wear this to work out in I could wear it just how I have it paired right now with some sandals call it a day speaking of sandals hold one minute I got some shoes too so this was something with gaining weight that I didn't realize I can't wear regular shoes anymore they have to have like a good bit of padding in them which these do I also have never had a wide foot and I was never able to wear Torrid or Elaine Bryant shoes but now I need them so I got quite a few of their shoes these are just the black with the studs I love these so much although I'm kind of undecided because I wore them earlier today and as I was walking I was like is my foot too small for these or is it too big because I kept feeling like I had to like they were falling off my feet I don't know but hold on this is what they look like I'll go closer so y'all can see them up close but they're super cute and they're very 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 comfortable and they're gonna go with so much stuff even if I don't wear them outside I'm noticing with my ankles and my feet especially this one like oh my gosh like right now this ankle is killing me like if I go a certain way like this or it just hurts so bad because of the extra weight so even if I don't wear these out I'm gonna keep them because just having that extra padding when I'm cutting up fruit doing meal prep cooking in the kitchen it just it's nice or even just like walking around the house cleaning okay I don't know my camera just stopped recording I don't know when it stopped but I was showing you all these shoes that I got they're an eight and a half I am normally a size nine I was saying I used to never be like I still don't really have a wide foot which is why I have to size down to an eight and a half in Torrid but these fit really well um, I was saying how I wore them earlier today and I felt like they were kind of falling off so maybe these are going to be inside shoes for me but it's gonna be perfect because of the padding I have a lot of ankle and feet problems and pain because of my extra weight that walking around the house in the hardwoods is like really killing my feet and my ankles so having these padded shoes is gonna really help me out so I don't know if it's if it was recording when I held them up I think it was but here they are up close they're just so cute and I really love them let me show you the other ones I got hold on okay so don't be bad at me but I don't want to try these on because I have to put them around my ankle and I just don't feel like doing that right now but these are so freaking cute they are pink which I am obsessed with I mean you cannot go wrong with pink shoes especially if you wear a lot of black Oh my gosh, girl, seriously. You just, you just put your foot in and then these do go around the ankle. They are studded. They are just perfection. These also are an eight and a half and I am just obsessed with them. I have these in the clear strap with the silver studs. I love them. I wear them so much. They're so comfortable. I don't feel any ankle pain or any foot pain whenever I wear these and I will, especially if I know I'm going to be walking somewhere for a, for a good bit, I will definitely wear my Torrid shoes and I will wear the, the ones that you, you guys saw, the, the black T-strap ones. Those ones are padded but they're not padded like these so if I'm going to be like going to the mall or going somewhere where I know I'm going to be walking for an extended period of time, I will put these ones on because these just have a lot more support and a lot more padding. So I got those and then I also, I'm unsure about these, I showed y'all to these, I showed y'all these on my vlog. Oh my gosh, so, like the color is just, it's so beautiful, it's so beautiful, like I don't know if y'all can see or tell but it's like a hot hot pink it is so freaking pretty but when I put them on my foot it just kind of fly off the end and then I keep feeling like I have to like keep stuffing my foot in and then the side of my big toe starts to hurt because I feel like I'm like squishing hold on Here they are right here. So I feel like I'm like squishing my feet into them 
But again, very padded, nice and squishy and cushiony love. These are so pretty. And then again, if you are, like if you wear a lot of black, oh my gosh, like so, so, so good. And these are not super loud. You know how sometimes these kind of shoes can be like really, really, really loud? I don't know. What do y'all think? Should I take them back? Because right now, you know, it's not hurting that bad. I was going to say like, oh, I'll just keep these for like my inside shoes. And then that way, I don't know. It seems to be fine. I'm really a stickler. Like I do not like my foot to be over the front or on the end of the back. Like it has to fit. My foot has to fit in a shoe. So this just gets, you see how right there, how it's just like, it's like off the shoe. So that's my issue too. And then I have to like stuff my foot in there so it can fit, you know? So my ankle or my heel isn't off the shoe. But then I just feel like then my foot feels like it has to be stuffed in there. I don't know. Some of y'all said that these did stretch out, so I'm still kind of undecided on them. They're such a pretty color though. They're such a pretty color. So yeah, those are all of the shoes, and now we are going to get into workout stuff. When I tell y'all, like I understand tour is expensive, I get it. But some of us, tour is really our only option. I know that they have a 4X. I think that Fabletics goes up to a 4X. Well, 4X doesn't fit me. So I have to really go with Torrid. I had a couple of workout clothes, but I was just having to wear them over and over and over and I got really bored. So for me, I was like, you know what, Jill, you did really good with your first month and you killed your workout. So I'm gonna treat you, like we're, you're gonna treat yourself. You're gonna treat yourself to some workout clothes. They're so good, y'all. Such good quality. And when y'all see what I got, don't ever pay full price at Torrid. Don't ever pay full price. But seriously, you get what you pay for with their workout clothes. You really, really do. I don't like their, their sports bras. I do not like them. But their, at least their leggings and their shorts, they're really good. The shirts, you know, they're, they're good. They're okay. But if you could find them somewhere else cheaper, go with them. But yeah, let me go try more. I mean, y'all, I just, they fit so good. All of the pants, they're actually um, shorts, but I also did get one pair of pants. So let me, all of the, all of the bottoms are a size three and they all fit. This top is a size two. It has ruching on the side. Super cute. This could even be a super casual wear with jeans or shorts kind of shirt. This is what it looks like in the back. These shorts though, I'm telling you, you're in, okay? You're not wiggling and jiggling. These are so, so, so good. They have a thick waistband. As you can see, these look literally like a pool. I am such a pool fanatic. I love going swimming, but you also have some very, very, very deep pockets, which for me are an absolute must. I actually got rid of every single legging and shorts that did not have pockets because they don't serve me. Like I need to have pockets. So yeah, this is so cute. These are so like, I mean, come on, look at them. Look at them. They're just perfect. I love them. And this shirt, again, is a classic and can go with pretty much anything that you pair it with. So good. Y'all can tell I am obsessed with pink and I love, love, love the fact that I'm able to find pink more and more. These are so good. And they cover your whole leg. So if you're self-conscious of your, you know, of having them this short, you don't have to. They're to the knee. Oh my gosh, they're so good. These are a little see-through, so I do like to make sure that I wear something that covers the butt with them. But again, same thing, pockets. You just feel like wide waistband. Love, love, love the baby pink. So pretty, I just feel so girly and uh, I love. Okay, these shorts, classic black, only you have a ribbed, 
waistband right here, which is nice and soft. It just, it feels so incredibly good. Like, so good. I don't even know if you can tell that it's ribbed. This is the only part of the short that's ribbed. So yeah, again, pockets down to the knee. Fits really well. This tank right here is one of their workout tanks. As you can see, it has an open back, which I absolutely love. As you can see, also, I am wearing a strapless bra because I'm doing try-ons today. And uh, I need to do strapless bras and I do try-ons. But when I'm working out, obviously, I will wear a sports bra. And just this just looks so cute with a really pretty strappy sports bra in the back. Love. And then you have, this is a size 2 as well. Um, love the pink. You have wide straps. So if you wanted to wear... Yeah, like wanted to even if you just wanted to wear this like with a bra and some jeans or whatever, you can totally do that. This one is like a little bit you can't really see my bra, so it's not that bad. This one does go longer in the front, shorter on the sides, long in the back again, and then again the back is out. So you can wear your cute little strappy sports bras. Or if you have some really pretty lacy bralettes, this would look really good with that as well. Okay, now these black biker shorts are different from the other ones. First of all, they don't have the ribbed waistband, and they're a little more suck you in, kind of constricted, whereas those were a little bit more soft and didn't have as much, you know, to them. So these are still so good. I don't feel like... You know, sometimes with compression, especially with the leggings, sometimes you can feel like, you know, like when you're like having to go to the bathroom or you're having to like really, and it hurts sometimes. So I did not want any of that. It was like, no ma'am, no, I'm not interested. So when I tried these on, that's what I was worried about. No issues. They're constricting and they hold me in without being tight, too hot, too thick. Um, let me see what I, I did have a tag over here for the pants. These ones are for the ribbed biker shorts. So they have a four way stretch. They're breathable, maximum coverage, lightweight, but never see through moisture wicking. So it keeps you dry when things get steamy and smoothing light compression to smooth and enhance those curves i feel like this one has a little bit more compression than the ribbed one that you just saw me have on do but not too much more but i feel lifted i feel i feel good i feel confident this one is see-through it's not see-through in the fact that you can like completely see through it but you know you can kind of like see my stomach it's whatever if you're comfortable with it you are if not then you're not I love it I absolutely love it and it's so comfortable I wore this yesterday I feel so good in it and yeah wait till y'all see these last I have not taken the tag off yet let me show y'all I haven't taken them off yet because the only thing that concerns me is the fact that I got a pair like a really bright shirt let me turn down the brightness real quick of this camera y'all are probably gonna be mad at me because y'all probably were like oh it was too bright the whole time i hope it wasn't but these oh my gosh they're so pink and they're so bright and they're so vibrant and they're so beautiful i bought a sweatshirt some of y'all remember back in the fall and it was bright beautiful vibrant loved it washed it one time and it faded drastically so I'm kind of like, <laughs> I'm kind of scared to keep these because I don't want that to happen again. They are really good though. They are really good. Let me see, what does it say as far as like how to, these are the same thing by the way, four way stretch, breathable, maximum coverage, moisture wicking, smoothing. These are also a size three. It doesn't really say how to wash them. Hmm, that's kind of disappointing. Oh, right here. Turn garment inside out. Machine wash cold with light colors. Okay, let's try them on. I mean, do y'all see how bright and beautiful these are? They're so vibrant. They are like hot, hot pink. They go with my shoes. 
these well actually these are a little more hot bright kind of, this is this is kind of like a neon so pretty fits so well these are a little see-through because probably because i'm like stretching them to the max um which is fine i'm just gonna get some nude underwear because i actually realized i don't have any nude underwear i know don't judge <laughs> but i mean this does cover my butt the only thing is a lot of times i'll just like you know when you're sitting and stuff like that it kind of moves and makes it way up the, it makes its way up there and then you can kind of see so yeah but oh my gosh these are so good they're so good i know i'm standing far away because of the way my camera is situated but they're so good and they feel so good. They're stretchy again, everything with the pockets. They're very deep. <sighs> so good. I just, I, I'm scared. I'm scared to keep these because I'm scared that it's going to not be so vibrant once I wash them. So if y'all have any suggestions and any tips, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you see me, I'm a sweaty mess. Excuse me. Whew. Y'all, it was like a marathon. <laughs> Trying on clothes is no joke. I had to go fast because I gotta go pick up my son, so I'm like, oh my gosh, I gotta go, I gotta go. Um, he's, uh, he's working now. My son, oh, I love him so much, and I miss him so much. This is actually his first, it's orientation for him. And even though I'm working, I'm so, I went to his door the other day, like, the other day. I went to his door, or I went by his door because I went to go get Ava, and I was like, he's not in there. Um, but I'm so happy for him. He's he's going to love it. So anyways, I love you guys. Everything is going to be linked down below in the description box in the order in which I have tried it on in. Go get your hands on these pinks, y'all. Seriously, the shoes, the, the shirts, the pants, the bottoms, like those pool bottoms. They're so good. The, uh, that's what I'm going to call them, my pool shorts. Um, these, like, are so vibrant and beautiful, like so hot pink. Love just obsessed. I've been so obsessed with the color pink lately. I'm just like, I cannot get enough of it. So anyways, I love you guys. If you are new here, please subscribe, click the notification bell. So you're always notified of every single upload. You guys are amazing. I hope you have an awesome day. I hope you love on yourself and show yourself grace and gratitude and thankfulness and thank your body no matter what state it's in, that you truly thank your body for everything that it does for you. Because our bodies do a lot. No matter what state it's in, overweight, little overweight, morbidly obese, it doesn't matter. Our bodies do so much for us. So let's be kinder to them and also be kinder and more gentle with ourselves. I love you guys. Have an amazing day and I'll see you in the next one.